note like and subscribe the channel please um, go to the google or youtube and search for the alien tag champion and uh, and just uh, like and subscribe the channel if you are new to this channel this channel is all about regarding if you want to know something more about microsoft intune or apple ios android or any mobile operating system or in fact windows operating system as well so in this video i am going to um, say you what is the use of device enrollment manager and how this is the microsoft intune portal you can call and if you go to this enroll devices you see the device enrollment manager so what is the use of this um, device enrollment manager you see add and remove device enrollment managers to allow certain users to enroll larger quantities of devices so hope you understand right so if you want to enroll more than i mean larger like 100 or 200 with with a single account you can you use this device enrollment man manager so what is uh, uh, what is the device enrollment manager you can go into the detail this dem is a non administrative user who can enroll devices into intune so this this is useful uh, to to have when when you need to enroll and prepare as many devices for distributions right so people sign in with this dem account can enroll and manage up to thousand devices so up to not more than thousand devices while a standard standard non-admin account can only maximum up to 15 right as you know so if you create if you have a dem account you can enroll up to thousand devices if you don't have dem account you can enroll maximum 15 right and you can define it so this dem account required an intune users or device license so of course and an associated azure ready users uh, and this is uh, useful when when you want to give the devices to the end users with i mean enrolling with this dem account or if you have a shared kind of devices you can use that and you see this support enrollment method bulk enrollment uh dem initiated with the company portal so you can bulk provision or or you can just uh, sign in with azure ready so this is the and the permission you need the intune administrator and global administrator so what you have to do is simple just go to this uh endpoint manager and click on add and give the name like i'm just giving exports okay mbm exports no Okay, let me find one user sorry for that so uh, user i hope i have some users huh is it this one is there so go to the intune search for this one yeah and add it Okay, you see added and you can just delete it so this is the process I so just go to the devices enroll devices as I have shown you select the device enrollment add and add username the new device enrollment manager added to the DMM user if you want to remove someone just delete it limitation right you you must know the limitation the device enrollment account can't be used with all the future in Microsoft into as has some limitation when used to the these sections will limit it like indoor enterprise you can enroll up to 10 personally owned devices with work profile and can't be set by a dem right so app assignment D dem isn't compatible with apple a device enrollment program so these are the limitations right you you must use the device level certificate conditional access device limit restrictions as well so device limited so want to work on them and on windows 10 devices in tune company portal devices user can't wipe the from the company portal and there is a limit of 150 dem cells. so you you cannot add more than 150 dem accounts so you know uh, you can with one account you can enroll up to 1000 devices and you can add 150 uh, 
150 uh, you can add 150 dem account here and you you should know the limitation about this as well okay so i hope uh, you learn how what is the device enrollment manager and what is the use of uh, dem and uh, i hope you can incorporate with your uh, in your organization or wherever you work in thank you have a good day and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you bye bye